If you are someone like me who loves the ease of Anaten Cloud and also wanting the community nodes but don't want to self-manage the Anaten, this video is for you. And also if you don't know what is community node, stick to the end because we are going to find out this amazing thing of community node which will change the way you use the Anaten. So Anaten just released the big update of theirs. They are releasing a community node available on Anaten Cloud. So till now uh, community nodes were there but they were in the self-manage where you have to download the community node and use in your workflow. So now they are expanding the Anaten ecosystem and unlocking the new feature. So you might be having a question, what is community node? So Anaten has a fixed amount of stream. So they create the node which are very useful in, the, in our workflow. So there are so many different different use case for which we have to write the HTTP access if they have API and we can using that API write the code over there. For example, Tavili, 11 Labs, all these things are available via API. So we need to write the HTTP node and access them. And now they officially have their own nodes. You can see Tavili nodes and 11 Labs nodes. I'll tell you how to install this. So currently there are nearly 2000 community nodes with over 8 million downloads. And on top of that, they have added more 25 nodes. So this is the initial release. So they are only releasing 25 nodes over here. But with more and more updates, we'll get more and more community nodes. So from here, you can see some of the nodes which they have made available with the community node. So we can see there is 11 Labs. Then there is Top API. Then there is kind of Brave, which is coming soon. They have written over here. So in the upcoming feature, we will be getting the Brave community node over here. So to see how we can install and see the community nodes which we have in our workflow, let's check it out. So in the workflow, whenever you click on plus icon, just go to extend app. So these were the original nodes which we have. But the tick sign before any of the node over here, it means that it's a community node. So if I click on it, you can see we can install this node. These are the action which we'll get with the node installed. Okay. So for example, if I search Tavili, so I can see this Tavili is a community node. You can see tick over here and I have installed it. So it, it is showing installed over here and we can do the search and extract. So the earlier way when we used to do the Tavili search, we can see we have to write in such a sense. So for the header path, we have to write the authorization bearer than token over here. Correct. But now with the community node, what I can do, I can just come over here, click on plus icon, search for Tavili and go for the search part. And instead of the search, I can get everything in the account part. Whenever you need to create the account, we can create the new credentials. And you can see we don't have to write the authorization bearer and token. Just paste the API key and you're good to go. Okay. So I'll use my Tavili uh, node over here. Inside this, we have all the options over here. We have query, what is AI automation. If you see in the URL, we have topic, search, depth and everything. If you go to the node over here, you can go for the add option. Inside this, we can see everything. Topic, search, depth, all the options which we get with the HTTP access will get over here. So now the question is how you will get access to all this community node. So for that, you have to go to the admin panel. So inside the admin panel, you can see my version is 1.94.1. So you should be on this version. If you go to the setting, inside this, install this 1.94.1 uh, version over here. Toggle on the beta, uh, beta version of verified community nodes. Using this, you will get all the community nodes. If you want to disable all the community nodes, just disable it and all the community nodes will be gone. And do the save change. Within a few seconds, your system will up again. Then you can go to your workflow. Just click on the plus icon. And over here, you can see the community nodes, click on it and do the install part. Then that node will be installed in your system. If you want to see what all community nodes you have installed for that, click on the three dots over here, click on the setting. Inside this, you can see community node. And from here, you can track all the community nodes which are installed in your cloud version over here. So this is so great over here, right? So I hope you got the understanding of community nodes and how massive they are. So in the future version, they will be releasing new and new version. Comment below which community nodes you are eagerly waiting for. I am eagerly waiting for MCP community nodes using which I can connect to any MCP server out there. If you like the video, please press the like button, subscribe to my channel. We'll meet in the next video. Till then, take care.